hey guys, Austin here, and welcome to another episode of Minecraft Pixelmon, everyone. And today, we are going to be, hopefully, defeating the legendary boss. That's right, guys, I'm sick and tired of him be just pushing us around, always beating us. Say, we are not giving up until we defeat him. So, today's episode is just going to be facing him one-on-one -on -one over and over and over again until we have a strategy down pat and know we're going to beat him. So, I just want to say, if you guys are excited and want to see more of the series in the future, definitely hit that like button, show your support, and subscribe to my channel too as well if you want to see... Wow, I completely forgot how to say that. if Because we do modded content every single day of the week in Minecraft. So, yeah, that's a thing. And also, if you missed yesterday's uh, Minecraft War episode or the two mod showcases, I definitely check those out too if either of those are your cup of tea. And let's get into this episode. So... If you're new to this Pixelmon adventure, basically we are in the newest version of Pixelmon, and not a single legendary has ever spawned. That's basically all I can say the series has been. No legendaries. Unfortunately enough. But, I'm confident it'll happen one of these days. I mean, there are new versions coming out soon. I'm assuming it's going to be version 6.0, and it's going to have generation 4 in it. So that's even more legendaries to not spawn in my world. But yeah. So, whenever that happens, be sure this will be one of the few uh, survival series for Pixelmon that will be up to date that moment in time. And I'll definitely be doing a mod showcase on version 6.0 once it releases. I'm assuming that's what this version number is going to be. But yeah, so definitely uh, stay hyped for that. And yeah, let's get into this. So, we also have two gym badges. We didn't get the third gym badge yet because I'm waiting to take that one on. Um, but... Let's go and I guess start finding the le our legendary boss. First, let me see what kind of items I have because I feel like if I had some cool items helping me out, like here, I'm gonna give myself a super potion. I'm gonna give myself some soda pops. I'm gonna give myself some fresh water. I don't know exactly how much HP those restore, but I know they do stuff for revive orb. Uh, burn heal. Let's take antidote. Let's take. Yeah, I'm just gonna basically have all my like items to use right here for now. Anything else? I don't think. Yeah, we don't really have anything else we can use. Oh, I forgot I have a Rocky Helmet on Bastiodon. Okay. Now, if I go to my P... Oh, I completely forgot about him. Yeah, we had that guy uh, cultivating here, so let me quickly get a Pokeball and give it to him. So, here you go. Um, Guys, we just caught a Lily. Let me just go to my PC really quickly and uh, analyze him. So, if we do slash IV6... 53% IVs, okay, he's not too bad, but he's not too good either. Uh, he's decreased attack. Um, I'm pretty sure he's physical attack, so he's probably got the worst nature in his group of things, so that's cool. Now, looking at what we have, 40, 43, 44, I think I'm going to swap out Tropius for Gyarados. Just while this is going on, because right now, like, the way it's looking... I don't know how we're going to pull this off with Tropius. Because Tropius is like the one that doesn't do well for some reason. Um, I'm not entirely sure why. But yeah, we're going to not use him in this fight. I'll grab Gyarados out. Um, any others that are very close level I could use? I don't want to use guys the Dragonite or the Tyrantar. Because they're both 60. And that would dramatically increase the levels of what I have. Also last episode we caught a Poochyana in case you guys missed that. Just thought I should say. Um, but yeah. I don't want to use Tyranta or uh, Dragonite because their levels will increase. But now we got Gyarados. So let's put Gyarados on the front lines up here. So let's just move him up. There we go. And looking at my team, I think we're good. Um, do we have any last minute TMs we could learn? Any last minute? Like... Sky drop. Let's check and see if anyone can learn that. I know no one can learn Shadow Ball because reasons. Solar Beam. I don't. We don't already have someone that can learn that. Uh, Bullet Seed, Secret Power, Silver Wind. No, no, no. Mega Drain. No one can learn that. Uh, actually, we'll check. I need to check Swampert for that one. Swampert, come here. Can you learn Mega Drain? No, you cannot. Okay, fair enough. I thought it was a good shout. Uh, Garrus, you can't learn Sky Drop. Okay, never mind. Like, it's the, it's sometimes weird what Pokemon can learn what moves. Like, it can just happen, even though it doesn't seem like it would be the right type of move. But 
Also, before we go, let's check our chicken pen. How many eggs have you guys laid today? Two. Well, we got a baby chicken out of that, so hopefully that'll help you guys out here. Wait, here's another egg. Oh, two baby chickens. Yep, you guys will be fine. Um, Yeah, I think we are ready to go. And hopefully if we can beat him today, we can actually get uh his drops finally. Now, I do want to swap this out because I need Bash it on in the front line. So our strategy is... What we're going to have to do is predict when Grimer comes. Grimer's the one issue because Grimer has the ability to poison us. Not like we've been doing that to him at all or anything. But um, not only can he poison us, but he also is not really a f super... F like, none of my Pokemon are super effective because he's poison type. I need a ground slash psychic move to hit him. And none of my Pokemon have psychic moves. And I think Bastiodon... Is that ground? No, that's rock. Yeah, he doesn't know any ground type moves. None of my Pokemon know ground type moves, so I can't hit him with that. Except, wait, Swampert? Oh, never mind. Swampert knows much shot. That's a ground type move. So, if we can keep Swampert alive long enough to be able to kill um, Grimer, then we're good. Also, Clink is one of his last Pokemon. It's also a trouble because he knows metal t steel attacks. Um, Infernape would be his weakness or Ninetales, either or. So, we got that. And his Umbreon knows Moonlight, which means he can heal. So that's the other problem, because since he can heal himself constantly, even if he's badly poisoned, like my thing gives it to him, he can stay alive pretty long as long as he keeps spamming Moonlight, but then he can't attack. So, well, without further ado, I guess let's get into this, guys. 3, 2, 1, legendary boss fight. Let's do this. So, I guess first things first, let's just target. So... I'm going to predict. I'm going to badly poison seal, so I'm attacking Umbreon with Mudshot, and I'm going to Toxic Seal. Use Confused, Brace Swampert became confused. Aurora Beam hits Swampert. Okay, Swampert's confused. Can't do anything. Bastion use Toxic. Perfect. Okay, Swampert, you are confused. I'm going to swap you out immediately for Lapras, and I'm going to Toxic Umbreon, which means he will swap out. Most likely. I'm going to use Sand Attack to increase accuracy. Seal used Endure, but he's still toxic. Okay, they're both toxified. That's good. Now that that's the case, I'm going to have my Lapras use... Let's see. How do I want to do this? Water Pulse on Umbreon. And Bastion, I'm going to have you use Toxic again on Seal. Because I'm trying to make him swap out his Pokemon. Okay, Water Pulse did hit. I think it did confuse them also. They're both taking poison damage, which is good. I don't want to swap out Bastiodon for any particular reason currently, because the way this is set up, if I do swap him out, then I won't be able to use Toxic on any more Pokemon. So, again, let's use Water Pulse on Seal, and I'm going to, once again, use Toxic on Umbreon and hopefully force a swap out. Okay, Flappy has, has entered the fray. Perfect. Um... We didn't get it confused, but it's okay. Umbreon is badly hurt currently. I can finally use Brine on Umbreon since he's lower than half health. And I'm going to use Toxic on Flaffy. Swaps out to Seal. Okay, interesting. Electro Ball hits Lapras. Pretty devastating, but if we can just... Oh no, we didn't Toxic uh, Flaffy. Okay, so Lapras, I'm going to have you use Brine once more on Seal. And I'm going to use Toxic on Flaffy. So, if we can just... Oh, we lost Lapras. Okay, that's fine. Um, avoid the attack again? How do you do that? Okay, um... Hmm. Currently, what we're up against, we should use Swampert since he's a ground type. Alright, good. Now, Swampert, use Mudshot on Flaffy. Bastiodon, use Toxic on Flaffy, please. He swaps out once more to Grimer. Okay, this is our chance, everyone. This is our chance. It's super effective. Toxic on Flappy, perfect. Alright, Swampert, use Mudshot on Grimer, would you? And Bastiodon, use Toxic on Flappy, and hopefully we'll force a swap out. Yes to Umbreon. Yes, Mudshot hits Grimer. Perfect accuracy there. Bastiodon's taking a little bit of damage. I think I'm going to have him actually um, take a little bit of some medication this time. Let's use Mudshot once more on Grimer. Bastiodon, I'm going to go to my items. Status Restore, no, we don't want Status Restore. We want to HP Restore. I'm going to have you use a Super Potion, so we'll heal you up. Perfect. Swaps out Grimer to Seal. Umbreon uses Confused Ray Swampert's now confused. Okay. Okay. But it still hits, so Seal is going to die this round. Perfect. I cannot worry about him anymore. Umbreon? 
let's just get a water gun on Umbreon. It doesn't really matter. Bastion Toxic. Or no. Yeah, Toxic on Umbreon. Swap's that seal to Grimer again. I should have predicted that. Okay. Okay. Is Umbreon dead yet? Come on. He hasn't used Moonlight also, which is pretty interesting. Mudshot on Grimer. Bastion. I'm going to have to use actually Metal Burst on Grimer as well. Flareon. I did not expect that. Okay. Swampert, once more, I'm gonna have to use Mudshot on Grimer. Bastiodon, he's toxic on Flareon. Oh, Bastiodon got taken down. Okay. Snap side confusion. Flaffy may or may not die. No, Flaffy's still alive. I need a new Pokemon. I'm gonna use Ninetales now. Because Grimer is badly beaten. So I just need to make sure I take down Grimer. Okay, Swampert. Use much No, wait, wait. How do I want to do this? Use Water Gun on Flareon. We're going to have to take down Flareon now. Use Confused Ray on Flareon. We have to make sure Flareon gets hit with this all. Okay, Flareon's Confused and Water Gun. Perfect. Flaffy's Electro Ball. Didn't do much. Once more, Water Gun on Flareon. And Nine Tails. I'm going to have you use Confused Ray on whatever Flaffy's next thing is going to be. So Swampert took a ton of damage. Oh, no, just Flaffy got confused. Okay. That might not have been worth it at all, but... Ooh. Okay, Umbreon's going to die regardless. Ninetales took, got a ton of experience there, but he's very weak. If I go to my bag, I think it's time to use our revive on Bastiodon. So Bastiodon is going to be revived. Ninetales, I'm going to have you use Quick Attack on Umbreon. Perfect. Umbreon's out. And Swampert's out too. But it's okay. Ninetales is actually leveled up from that. And you know what I'm sending out? Bastiodon. Because I know what I'm doing. Toxic on Flareon since he's back to normal. And I'm going to use actually Confused Ray on Grimer. Fire Fang Bastion. Dang it. But Grimer is confused so he can get hurt by confusion hopefully. I got two strong Pokemon to use. And I know who's still left in this. So Infernape, you're going to have to attack Clink with everything you got. But it's fine. I'm going to use Fire Spin. On Grimer, Nine Tails, Quick Attack, Grimer. Okay. Nullify because not here. Lava Plume hits. Not Lava Plume didn't. Wait, what? That's the first time Lava Plume's never actually killed. Oh, because Nine Tails is immune to it because he's fire. Okay. I'll tell. Uh, that's honestly good. Okay, so Seal is gonna die. I don't need to even worry about him. I'm gonna quickly use Fire Spin. I oh, will use Fire Spin on Seal. Why not? And Nine Tails use use Quick Attack on. Seal too. We need to take these guys out. Seal is down. Infernape is down. Oh, Gyarados, you're up. Wait, I just realized something. Gyarados is up. Oh no. This might be trouble. Gyarados. Ooh, ooh. How do I want to do this? How do I want to do this? I don't want to use Hydro Pump, do I? Fine. Gyarados use Hydro Pump on Flareon. Withdraws Flareon for Clink. Oh no. This is bad. Wait, Clink is Steel type. What is Steel type? Crap. I don't have anything that can damage it. Well, I do have stuff that can damage it, but I don't have anything major that can damage it. Oh, we're equal. We are literally equal. And I think he still has Flareon at the end. But. And his Steel is glitched out, let me just say. Oh no, no, no. Vice Grip's a lot. Uh, Dragon Rage. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Don't kill him. Okay. No! No, wait, 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 why did you hit me twice? No! I didn't know Vice Grip could actually hit me twice, and now I think I... We broke the game. Guys, okay, guys, we're back. We literally broke the game. We actually broke the game. Ninetales, don't, don't look at that, guys. Ninetales is actually dead. Um, but yeah. You want to know how we broke the game? <laughs> oh, boy, that, that was funny. Um, so... I don't know why, but it didn't want to tolerate me losing that. Minecraft itself did not want me to lose that fight, so it was like, no, no, Aerie didn't actually lose. Crash, 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 gone. I don't think Vice Grip is supposed to hit twice in a row like that. Unless that's his special ability. Because Vice Grip is a move where, like, oh, I think he just kept using Vice Grip. Because Vice Grip is, like, one of those, th like, rap. Like, it hits the opponent and then it does damage over time. But he kept using Vice Grip on top of Vice Grip, which is kind of funny. I don't know how gears can exactly... Well, I guess they can. That ought to be painful, though. Uh, but yeah, we... Guys, 
I want to say we could do that again, but the problem is last time we had a revive and a, like we don't have revive. Can you craft revives? Oh, you actually can. Guys, we're going to head back home really quickly and see if there's any more items we can manage to scrape up. Because that was, um, wow. Wowzers, that's all I can say is wowzers. Okay, we got gold. Do we have apples? Please tell me we have apples. Yes, we do. Okay. See, the problem is, though, even if I can... Here, we'll craft 14 of them. Just overkill. Why not? The problem is, though, if, uh... See, revive worked for a second, but he just got one shot again. So I need someone that can tank it after being revived. Ugh. This is so hard. And why? Oh, yeah, I need him in that position. That's right. I was like, why is he in that position? But, guys, we did extremely well. Let me just say, we literally got him down to his last poke because he still had. It was either Seal or Flare, and he still had, but they both. No, he had Seal still. Seal was literally at one inch of HP. Like, he was going to die, regardless of what he did. So we just had to take down Clink, and we could not take down Clink. What is this? And yet, well, the good thing is Ninetales grew level, so he'll be able to be a tiny bit stronger in this fight. But, oh, that was just so bad at the end there. Not bad as in, like, like horrible bad, but just, it was bad because we didn't pull that off. Dang. That was amazing, though. Okay. We're going to go in for another try. And this battle is taking way longer than I ever expected it to. Like, I thought we'd be doing, like, 20 rounds today. But, no, this is clearly going to be, like, a two-round thing. I'm trying to think, is there any last minute here? Wait, let me see if I can go to the HM shops, TM shops, whatever. Is there any last minute move I could get that would just make me invincible? Um, no, 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 no. I want... Oh, you can actually buy revives. Oh, I just craft it. Wait, wait, what do you have? What do you have? What do you have? What do you have? Ice heal, revive, burn heal, burn heal. Four stores. Can I buy... No, can I buy full restores? Oh, I'm rich. Yes, I can. I'm just going to buy five full restores. Because those, if you guys don't know, are basically like, um... They take... they. We don't need the antidotes anymore, actually, now that I think about it. So let's sell those. Just free up some... So full restores are basically... After a revive, it, like, puts your health all the way to maximum again. It restores, like, everything. Toxic. We could buy another Toxic. Fire Blast, Volt Switch, Pluck, <laughs> Dynamic Punch is a good one. Fire Punch. We'll take a Fire Punch. Um, Volt Switch, Fire Blast. We'll take a Fire Blast. We'll take another Toxic, actually. I love being rich. All right, let's head to the other TM shop. See what they have. There's actually a Villager in here, which is pretty funny. All right, what do you have? Uh, You don't have anything cool there, but let's check you out. What do you have? Blizzard. Ooh, I didn't think of... Or Dig. Oh, wait. Can we get a Dig? I think Bastiodon can learn Dig. That's such a cool... Like a... Not a cool move, but that's such like a... A scumbaggy move. All right, let's take Blizzard as well. All right, we've got a good bit of TMs. Let's head home and check out what we can do here. So, Toxic. Can Swampert learn Toxic? I believe he can. Yes, he can. Give her a tackle for that one. Perfect. Um, here, wait. Bastion, can you learn Dig? Whoa. Yes, you can. All right, what do we want to get rid of? Rock Smash, for dang sure. Okay. What's this one that I get? Blizzard. Who's our ice type? Lapras. Blizzard, let's get rid of... Water Pulse, Brine, Ice Beam. Honestly? I'm not going to use Sing, I don't think, ever, so we'll get rid of Blizzard. I thought we would, guys, but there's no point. Okay, now Fire Blast and Fire Punch. Infernape is more of a... F wait a minute, before I do this, wait, wait, give up on it for a second. I need to check something for Infernape. Infernape, stats. He's neutral everything, but what's he higher in? Currently special attack. But it couldn't help to have a Fire Punch attack, right? Okay, so he's got Fire Spin, Flame Wheel. Automatically better than Flame Wheel, yeah. And what about Fire Blast? He's already got a move that's like a Fire Blast. So I don't want to give him that. We'll keep Fire Blast, honestly, for like the future if we need it for anything. Um, but yeah, that's perfect. I think with this, we could possibly win. Not to like... Alright, let's just go into it. Um, I wish I could have bought some Max Revives. 
Yeah, that guy didn't sell max revives. I don't think I might have missed it, but oh well. Legendary Arena. Let's go. Round two. My man, what's going on? Let's do this. All right. So, Seal and Umbreon. Nice to see you. Toxic. Toxic. What happens when we pimp when both my Pokemon can use Toxic, huh? What are you guys gonna do that? Toxic and Toxic. Perfect. Now we can actually do attacks. So, Umbreon, my dark friend. You're weak to fighting type moves. Too bad none of my Pokemon are fighting. Whatever. I'm just gonna use Mudshot on you and Bastiodon. Let's have you use Dig, actually. He's trying to heal with Moonlight. He's actually going the Moonlight strat this time. Wait, I didn't click use Toxic. What happened there? Or did he have me use Encore? I hate when he does that. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna use Mudshot on Seal, Bastiodon. Yeah, he's gonna force me to keep using Toxic. Whatever, I don't care. Encore my butt. You guys are taking more damage every time anyway. Swampert, Mudshot on Seal, Bastion on Toxic on Umbreon. He's using the Moonlight again. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> your your partner Seal's taking the beating here because of your strategies here, Umbreon. Um, oh wait, no, I can I don't have to use that anymore. Can you use, let's use Metal Burst. Now he swamps out. Okay, Flaffy's up. Flaffy took a huge shot because it was that attack. Okay. That's cool. Mudshot on Flaffy. Bastion use Toxic on Flaffy. Swaps out again to Grimer. He is not having it at all. Jeez. All right, Swampert, you're gonna use Mudshot on Grimer. Bastion. Wait. Ground. Ground. Dig. Grimer. Okay. Ooh, we took some damage there. But Umbreon's out. Perfect. Oh no, we have to take care of Flareon too. What's more important, Grimer or Flareon getting wiped out? Oh my god. I guess that answers that question. Why can't... Oh, Bastion used Dig. That's right. I was like, why can't he attack? Okay, we lost Swampert. Who do we want to bring out? Who do we want to bring out? Who do we want to bring out? Uh, I want to save Garrus for last. He's a good tank. Let's send out Ninetales for now. I think that's the best attack. We're going to confuse Ray Grimer. And Bastion use Toxic on Flareon. Okay, Flareon is definitely being a hard case this time. I'm gonna have to use Lapras as like a meat shield. I'm gonna use Confuse Ray on Flareon, Lapras, Bag, Revive. I need to bring back my Pokemon. Okay, he avoided the attack, Confuse Ray, perfect. They're both confused, this is my chance. Okay, so Bag, HP, Full Restore on Bastion, Bag, HP, Revive, Swampert. Okay, that should be perfect. And they're both just being confused right now, so this is also very perfect. Okay, we can go on the offensive again. Let's go with a flamethrower on Grimer, because he can get status effect burned by that. And we're going to go with a water pulse on Flareon. Wow. He was able to use a fire type move on Lapras. Lapras is still part ice, though. For the attack. No, we're poisoned. Okay. Okay, okay. Come back out, Bastion on Ninetales. Uh, I don't want to lose Ninetales yet. Flamethrower on Grimer. Bastion on, use Toxic on Flareon. We have to get that Toxic off. Why are you such a hard case? Oh my gosh. Okay, we got him. Jeez. Bastion will wipe down one turn by that. Okay, Swampert, you're back up again. Ninetales, I'm sorry. I'm going to have to use you for restoring purposes to bring back Bastion on. I'm going to use Mud Shot on Grimer. Flareon's confused. Perfect. Perfect. They're both very weak. And Flareon's out, actually. Flappy. Flappy was never poisoned. Ninetales leveled up, though. Okay, Ninetales. I'm just going to quickly confuse Ray Flappy. Swampert. Use Toxic on Flappy. Confuse Ray Flappy. Avoided it. Flappy got his attack off. Use Toxic. Toxic. Perfect. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to bring out Infernape now because I think in next will be Clink. But I'm not entirely sure. But we're going to do it anyway. Fire Spin on Grimer. Swampert, use Mudshot on Flappy. Lecture Ball. Ooh, that was devastating, but we got good hits off there. Infernape, I'm going to have you restore, actually. Full Restore on Infernape. And Swampert, Mudshot on Grimer, please. Full Restore. Mudshot, avoid the attack before you Okay, Flappy's out. Seal? Why? I don't want that. Infernape's leveled up now. 
Infernape, restore yourself again. I'm sorry I'm doing this. I just have to keep him at max, like, strength here. Okay, and we're going to Mudshot Grimer once more. Full restored. Perfect. Yes, Grimer's out. Clink. It's about dang time. Infernape, it's time to use your Flare Blitz and destroy Clink in one shot. Swampert, why don't you help him out and use Toxic on Clink also? Flare Blitz, knocked him down to one hit. Icy Wind, didn't do much to us. Swampert used Toxic, doesn't affect him. Of course, it doesn't. Oh no, Vice Grip. But it doesn't matter, guys. Um, Clink's out. Watch this Fire Punch on Clink. Swampert use, you know what, for the fun of it, Rock Smash on Clink. Fire Punch hits. Clink is out. Guys, we just beat him. Victory achievement unlocked. You've won the battle. You've received 5,000 Poke Dollars. Not to mention, I forgot this is what I gave myself. We got a Volcano Badge, an Item Finder, a Max Survive, and seven Pixelmon Lucky Blocks. I completely forgot that's even what I gave him for his uh, trophy. But guys, we did it. We actually achieved the unachievable. We beat the legendary boss. I am so happy right now. You have no idea. And also, we can disable our leveling now for two of our Pokemon. So, Infernape, disable leveling. And Ninetales, disable leveling. And Lapras is our last man that we need to get uh, leveled up. But, that was amazing. Honestly. And, is it, was it just me or was Rocky Helmet not working? I couldn't help but think that Rocky Helmet was not working at all there. I don't know. But, that was an amazing feat. Let me just say, we beat him. And, yeah, we can always come back to him now if we ever want to again. But, I don't really see the point in that. We also got a badge, so wait. Where's our, do we have any item frames? Item frames, item frames? Yes, we do. Let's let's chalk this up right here. Or do I want to put it on the other wall? No, let's just chalk it right here. Volcano badge, come here. There we go. We have defeated the Team Magma Grunt. I don't even know what I'm going to title this episode for crying out loud. You know, we're just making awesome a legendary spawn right now with three minutes left in this video. We also did get a max survive, which is pretty good. I'm going to keep those on me, keep the full restores on me. I'll put the water away. We don't really need that. But what's also great is... Guys, we got um an item finder. If you don't know what this is, basically, if you right-click it, it like does like a loading thing, and any random pokey loot that would be on the ground in your area, it points you in that direction, then you can go and find them. So that's an, a very, very good item to have. We actually don't need the hammer anymore. I honestly am just going to throw that in this chest over here right now. Um, and we got the Pixelmon and Lucky Blocks we can use next up, so I'll actually keep them in my inventory so I don't forget. But yeah, guys, I think we're going to end off this episode here. I'm not even going to fight the uh, spawn boss, the ultimate boss this episode, because, like, obvious reasons. Um, but yeah, I just want to say thank you all for watching. If you did enjoy this amazing episode, definitely hit that like button, show your support, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more Minecraft Pixelmon content in the future. And also let me know um, in the comments below what you think I should do next since I we kind of beat like our secondary main achievement of the series. We beat the ult the legendary boss. So yeah, comment down below any suggestions of what you think I should do in the future on the series other than hunting for legendaries because don't worry, I know. And also um, stay tuned for later on today because we're coming at you with a another uh, Lucky Block Survival Pixelmon edition. So and you know what's funny? I think I actually know what I'm going to do for that. But, um, also, guys, I wanted to also apologize, because I'm pretty sure this episode is go is definitely going to go up by the time it renders in everything pretty late compared to its normal time. So, as soon as it's done, I'll upload it, but I'm kind of running late today on the schedule for YouTubes, so it's probably going to go up a little bit later. So, I do apologize for that, but yeah, again... Stay tuned for the other episode going up also later on today, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.